what's the status of these two different breeds of crypt? Y'all get along? Do it's, we ever got to worry? It's like, the same you, breed of crypt. You got yeah, homies that all, can't be around his right. homies, or is that is that ever going to be a concern? It's, uh, it's a it's a wobbler. <laughs> it's a wobbler. No, it's a, be, uh, if we together, if we together, it's and good. We together, and we with the homies, then it's smooth. It's mm. this is what it is. Cause look, all right, me and him, our our hood, we straight, right? We don't have no problems. Long Beach, L.A. Where it comes in is it's another rolling hood that don't really yeah. got nothing to do with our card out there. So they lingo is like ours, and then they lingo is like our enemy shit. Right. So like. Us mixing in just native tongue, a nigga might say the wrong thing. That's the only thing that like, I can see. Necessarily, like, say if I say I don't fuck with, uh, with Roland, necessarily it's the niggas over here. N real niggas know who I'm talking about. Yeah. But niggas who want to play a little bit kind of be like, oh, well, oh, they saying oh, yeah, fuck yeah. up. And that's not what we say. We not low-key. We're not even thinking about over there because we not over there. It takes so, 45 minutes to go on that field trip. Like, we ain't, got no, trying to we do ain't that. got no real beef over there because <laughs> niggas ain't driving from Long Beach to L.A. You know, it's or, like another planet. Yeah. yeah. You know what I noticed, though? The, I get along with the... the Blood niggas treat me better than, than Crip niggas. I go to a random blood function, they'll walk in, DW, what's up? You need a gun, you need... I go to another Crip function, niggas like, see them niggas over there? Oh, them niggas is like, what the fuck is going on? Mm. There's so much turmoil in between <laughs> so this it's Crip shit. It's all like mixed weird. up. I, I, I rap. Right. Exactly. And once you... Went, that's where I'm like, I'm at the point to where... If you an artist and you really trying to do some player shit and you coming out your section, you ain't, man, I'm fucking with you. I don't give a damn where you from. As long as we trying to make L.A. look strong as one, mm. I'm with it. All mm -hmm. that fuck shit, that's where you can, like, miss me at. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, you still doing all the, like, going to the park and dissing niggas hood and all that. Like, all right, cool. I'll fuck with you at a distance. Like, mm. you'll never see me with that person. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Right, like, right. I'm not with that trolling, dissing niggas hood. They dead, they dead homies and all that. You'll I ain't even got time to be that. looking for niggas. <laughs> or I ain't, got, I ain't got time to do none of the unnecessary shit that we used to do literally when we didn't have shit. Mm -hmm. You feel me? Like, so, I mean, if I get into it with a nigga, it's probably a, a ego thing. And I'm like, yeah, I'm from there. And nigga be like, yeah, I'm from here. I'll exactly. be like, all right, bro. Nigga, we nigga, from there. But if he keeps saying it. Out, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. That's what it leads to. Yeah, you got two times to say your hood <laughs> yeah. down there, too. Right. It's like, like one and a half. Like, if the second both. time, it better not be over aggressive. You saying it harder than I just said it, said it to yeah, you. Yeah, I, okay. get, I get where this is going. If, if you're <laughs> in an L.A. party environment and somebody hits you with the way you're from and you say, I'm from Long Beach, or you say whatever it is you say, I mean, how does that go over? Because when you say you're from L.A. or from Long Beach, is it just kind of immediately like, oh, all right, that's like I don't, I don't usually say planet. I'm from Long Beach. I'm from Insane, so right. Right. that's yeah. probably how I come first. But literally, uh, shit, everybody know D.W., you know what I'm saying? Yeah. When I go somewhere, I done been around his homies, niggas that we the, the extra cool with, I'm good, you feel me? And I done had times where niggas pull up on me late night and, I'm in L.A. at a random gas station, and they like, you know, where you from? And I'm, you know, my body just, you know, I'm from insane where they could have called me. They're like, oh, okay. Surprised that I even bang. A lot of niggas wouldn't even, yeah. you know, get caught out of yeah, bounds. A lot of niggas, yeah, that's what. See, I was just about to say, like, if I'm in, in Long Beach and nigga asked me where I'm from and I'm from L.A., that's kind of like tuck a tail. Mm. You can't just say, "Oh, I'm from LA." Like that's mm. like you trying to avoid what the yeah, nigga. You trying can't to say. say that because mm. you is too much a part of yeah. your identity. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But any gang member that get asked that question, say, yeah, you yeah. gotta bang your hood. Like, mm. like not like that, but it's like you. Even if you like, oh, when I'm on the east side, like, hey, where you from? Like, I'm from six o. Some niggas be like, oh, I'm from the west side, bro. I ain't, mm. you know what I'm saying? And keep on going, like, nah, bro. You know what I mean? Like, that's kind of like Tuck and Tell. So what he telling you, like, I ain't never go come in and talk about Long Beach, this, that. But once you in L.A., once a motherfucker hear them, nobody's trying to ha add an extra hood on to they beat for real, mm. bro. Like, you know what I'm saying? You got some young, stupid niggas might be drunk off drugs and just start a problem with a nigga and just get the dissing out of nowhere. But, like, ain't nobody trying to add no extra hood on to what they beefing with. We already got these niggas around us that we really hella any, any crib shit embrace a nigga when they see me. Mm -hmm. Especially I'm out of bounds. It's me by myself. You know what type of nigga I am from what you see and what you 
Like, you know how you put people together. Mm. They know what type of nigga I am. Like, all right, fool, you, you know where you at? Like, yeah, I know where I'm at, nigga, Crip Street, whatever. But isn't like, I feel like part of the problem, right, is that there's just so many Crips in L.A. that there's not really, like, that same sense of unity because mm. there's so many. Mm -hmm. So it's, like, a lot of infighting. Whereas if a random Hoover runs into a random Hoover, it's, like, a smaller group. So they're more likely to find common ground. You t you tell me, yeah, am I but, tripping? But or is see, that that's more one hood that tur they turned into their own car. But so even yeah, like the bloods too, to. it's like a blood who runs into yeah, a yeah, blood. Yeah, it's kind of yeah, like yeah. more likely they're gonna yeah, be cool, a, right? right? Because yeah. they're kind of like a smaller percentage of the total population. Y'all see right? this shit, right? right? You got people outside of the culture that 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 see the the, the separation. It, mm -hmm. don't, it don't make sense, man. That's my whole goal for 2024 and going on is that at least. Like, let's go back to what community revolution and progress started at. You know what I'm saying? Some shit, some spilled milk you can't clean up. But if it's if it's a if it if it's a will, it's a way. So like we fighting battles that's 30, 40 years old, gang. Like if everybody could come to the table and stand on it, you know what I mean, and really take care and discipline the people that go against the the the, the peace treaty and the infrastructure, we could get somewhere. You know what it is? It's the money, champ. It's when this shit start making money again, mm. then you will see niggas start coming together. Exactly. You feel what I'm saying? Like, even my hood, personally, we got more bodies on ourselves than, <laughs> uh, than the ops, like, right now, specifically. So you say that about your peoples as well, because he definitely will say that there's more. Right. The he six, know that. Six He's old beef with each other right. more He's than He's been in California for sure. long enough. For sure. Yeah. Yeah. Everybody know that. And that's, that's just, like, and that's fucking crazy. But if we put some money, they're structured. Mm -hmm. No matter what. Because niggas want to be around or be in on this. Mm -hmm. Of course, it'll be some weird moving. But we got the new shit. What? It ain't too new, but everybody tell it. That ain't it's new. It's like, can we get... No, I'm just saying, no, <laughs> new no. Technology. And then we can't even it's put an viral. organization. Yeah, it's like viral tell it going on. Like, niggas used to snitch and get it's out the, the way back in the day. It's the, it's the one, the homie. The, the one homie can't homie. can't do it no more. The yeah, one that can't do it no more time. Cause. It's the one that... The, he got out. He did not... It's 35 years. <laughs> 35 year got home and then got back into some bullshit. And no, he can't, don't got another 35 to do. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Damn, so you saying that like snitching is really like that much more popular these oh, days? Oh, snitching is, nigga, look, snitching is five gangsters in a room, probably two, uh, two, two, two for sure, maybe. Maybe three. Maybe. <laughs> I, mean, I, I don't even know. Like you, And you never know. You feel me? Good thing I stopped doing the shit with niggas. Exactly. Because, mm -hmm. look, the statistics show we can say what we want, right? But the S&Y yards have overpopulated the general population yards. Mm -hmm. So we can say that niggas ain't telling like that. And no, it's not. It's a boom. If you have more PC yards than you have general population yards, that means that this telling shit is accepted. Like telling too much, cuz. <laughs> niggas telling for not, no reason. Literally, yeah. people telling for no reason. It's niggas out there who ain't had to tell. And then I understand the niggas who, once, once you sign up for it and you've been a part of it for years on years, mm. you can't want to change when you catch this case. Yeah. You could have changed before that. You could tell me, bro. I'm, you know, fuck this shit. I'm taking care of my family. I'm out the way, cuz. that we, we, we really respect that. Niggas don't know that. We, we respect that. Get up out the way if you can't handle it, bro. But it's just when people get up out the way at the opportune moment when they first start to have to deal with some shit. And now you have yeah. to deal with something. Now you telling yeah. on the homie? Yeah, like, like oh, You was yeah. the nigga starting shit. And now, now you want to get your life right. I don't respect kid, it. Yeah, you can't respect that. You can't. And it, I was going to bring something up, but I stopped bringing up people's names. But it's just like I said that about an older person from around my way. Like, we would have respected it if you would have just backed up. Like, man, there's too much going on in the hood. That's the last one I'm going to see. I'm through with this shit. I don't want to see it no more. I don't want nothing to do with it no more. Don't do what you're going to do and then sit there and still want to call shots and be involved and represent something that does not condone what you did.